putting all your eggs in one basket. As a coach, I work with career professionals who are currently dissatisfied with their financial positions. The standard of living of Nigerians has fallen. My still fall. God forbid, I just heard you say. But the economic indicators are showing a high inflation rate, a high unemployment rate, a high poverty rate. What this means for anyone in paid employment is that the purchasing power of the Naira is getting eroded. Prices of everything under the sun has gone up while your salary has remained the same. If this is you, you're still in luck. For some people, the current pandemic forced them to take a pay cut while others lost their jobs. COVID-19 brought to the fore the need for individuals with nine to five to diversify their sources of income. For us, because I'm one of them, to hedge against the adversity that could occur if we get a salary cut or get laid off from work. What then can we do to help ourselves as career professionals still in paid employment? Our first thought usually is to jackpot. Unlike in the past, when relocating abroad was for the unskilled or semi-skilled labor categories. Today, highly skilled workers have joined the rat race. The sad news is that not everyone wants to jackpot. Not every one of us can, even if we wanted to. What then can we do to help ourselves, those of us still in paid employment? The long answer is having multiple streams of income. That is, any money in addition to your salary. The short answer is for you to get a side business. The benefits of having a side hustle are many, but I will just highlight four. The obvious one being the opportunity for you to earn extra cash besides your salary. More financial security if you like. Two, a possible plan B. We can no longer say that we have job security. If anything, COVID-19 has taught us otherwise. Three, a side hustle helps you monetize your passion or your purpose. That thing you, you like doing for free, you like doing for fun, you can actually earn extra money from it. Four, a side hustle can also be a creative outlet for you. A lot of us fall in this fourth category. After the stress of being an employee, of being a spouse, a parent, a Nigerian, life becomes tiring. For some, life is simply frustrating. Most of us resort to fun things like golf, Netflix, massages. I use my side hustle to calm down. What do you use to calm down? No, before I talk about what I used to calm down, I need to know what your side yep, hustle is. Yep, exactly if your side what hustle thinking, can what's your side hustle calm down, no. I want to calm down that way as well. <laughs> so my side hustle, I coach people. So that's the way I help people. Mm -hmm. So sometimes, sometimes, helping people makes you feel good. Mm -hmm. Other mm -hmm. times, helping people make you, makes you know that you're better off. You know how? <laughs> so I mean, that's a bad example, but you get the point. Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah. <laughs> Whatever you want is good for you. Yeah. Well, your point is well taken. The economic situation we are in is in a quagmire, if I may use that word. It's quagmire. Uh, everybody just, in fact, enough of forming. I'm, I'm a big man with my suit and tie. In fact, if you have to get a blue collar job, we just yeah. I do it. For real? No, I, I, this morning I was having this conversation with a police officer. This morning we were talking about those in government. Uh, retiring, I mean, senior civil servant, senior public servant, retiring into abject poverty after mm -hmm. living an executive life in government without a proper planning. That's it. Yes, we know that they have to focus in the, in the, on their work as government officials, but think about your life after working for the government. And also think about your life after working in, any, in the private sector too. Mm -hmm. So I don't become... Um, useless to yourself. The only way they can achieve that is by embezzling. No, 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 I'll tell, I'll tell you. No, that's, <laughs> I joke, but that was the joke, but that's a fact. <laughs> I, met, I met a director at one of these federal institutions, and 
we were talking, and then I realized he earned 500,000 per month. He has kids in the university, parents to take care of. How do you manage? And he was, was it one of 500 or 300? I can't remember. But I think it was between three and five. And he didn't have a side hustle. He didn't have a side hustle. Mm -hmm. So he so, has the other side hustle. That's, uh -huh. <laughs> that, that's the only thing. So <laughs> he, he opened up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The informal sector. Mm. Majority of the population do not have a salary job. That is right. It. Mm -hmm. So they're doing multiple things mm -hmm. to survive. Mm -hmm. How much can they save? How much can I save? You know, I'm in the informal sector as well. Mm. Um, so these are things to think about. Yes, there's people in salaries who still have jobs, even with COVID-19, but your money doesn't go as far. You have to yeah. think about a side hustle. Mm. But majority of the population isn't in that space. And with the constant changing of rules and laws, Policies. what's allowed, what's allowed. Today, your business is, is working. Tomorrow, the government wakes up, has a dream, says something, and everything has scattered. Yeah. So there's no security. There's no planning. You can't plan. You plan yeah. for that week, that day, what you could eat. Who are you helping? You know, all those things are weighed down. And like you said, I am one of those who decided to stay. I can, I can, can get up and go, mm. but I've decided to stay. But even in that, I'm rethinking because it is so hard. It is hard. It is. There's so much pressure on everybody. It is in hard. In the informal sector, some persons in government are thinking of taxing Nigerians because they are making money. Well, it's not wrong to tax, provided that tax. the tax will be fair. And number two, they will put good use. But they will. Use, I'm uh, more concerned uh, about the use of the tax and exactly. the fairness of the tax. I the tell you, tax if I see what is being used for, you are not doing anything. Yeah. If, if, anyway. Provide an enabling yeah. environment for the people. You know, the, the thing is, you believe, you know, I believe people should take, pay taxes. Mm -hmm. But if you have the choice to eat or to pay that tax that has come in from that small mm. wave, and you're going to Which choose to be. eat, yeah. sure. you shouldn't have to make that decision. So, guys. It doesn't really matter your opinion on the side hustle debate. What is important is that you endeavor to earn income for more than your salary. Choose a source that helps you to maintain your health and your sanity. Remember, you are the cross of this and therefore you are your biggest priority. Mm. Next up is Uluwa Kayode after the break.